Hi, my name's Helen and this is my channel, Helen Mary Jo. If you're new here, then welcome. If you're returning, thank you. And if you're a Hell's Bell, hello. Um, so today is a collaboration with a new company called Daisy Silk. And uh, they approached me last year and um, we've been in dialogue for a while and um, I agreed to work with them this uh, winter kind of going into springtime and they've been a lovely company to work with and so I've chosen some beautiful products and I hope you enjoy them. Now personally I love silk, I love the feel of it on my skin, the luxury quality of it, you know there's nothing quite like it really and I'm 66 and a half and I have never owned a pair of silk pyjamas and uh, so when they said, what would I like? I'll confess, silk pyjamas weren't on the list, but I said, I'd really like a pair of silk pyjamas. I've never had a pair. Um, and I think they're just the height of luxury, really. So they said, okay, you know, you can have a pair. And I chose these, which I just think are adorable. And I've had cheekily had my HMJ put on here, um, which is a bit of fun. You can have that. I'm not sure if it's extra, but uh, it's quite a nice touch. Now, as with all these overseas companies, you do have to be careful to get the right size because returns are not as straightforward as they would be in this country, obviously. So if you're in doubt, I mean, with myself, they wanted my measurements, my height, my weights, everything in order to determine the correct size. And um, I've looked at everything, I'm hoping it all fits, but um, I started with the pyjamas for obvious reasons and they are adorable. They've also given me, I mean, I do wear a sleep mask nearly every single night actually, but if I put this on now, I'll muck up my hair and makeup. But um, I mean, it's so fancy, isn't it? And you know, silk is actually really easy to care for. People um, worry about silk. But I, I really don't worry about silk. I just wash it on a gentle wash in the machine. It irons up beautifully. And you know you can't actually burn silk. You can scorch it, but you can't burn it. And I have got a little story about that. So when Katie was getting married, um, she borrowed a veil off a family member, a beautiful full-length cathedral-length veil. And... Um, we borrowed it in the knowledge that it was silk. So I googled how to look after silk and it said, you know, you wash it gently, um, but you can't burn it. You can only scorch it. But, you know, you have to hold the iron there for quite some time to scorch the silk. So it was only about two weeks before the wedding. And I thought, right, I'll get the veil ready because obviously once it's done, you can't kind of put it away again. So I washed the silk veil and um, I was ironing it. And my brother-in-law, I'll never forget this as long as I live, as he walked in the back door, I burnt the veil. And uh, when I say burnt the veil, there was an iron shaped hole in the middle of the veil. And I, well, the air was blue. It's just as I say, just two weeks before the wedding. I borrowed it from a family member. I was mortified and I held it up and my brother-in-law helpfully said, it's right in the middle. I was like, I know it's in the middle. So anyway, um, to cut a long story short, I had to rush to the haberdashers. We had a really good fabric shop there where I used to live and um, bought the same veiling which wasn't silk, but it was a very fine tool, um, bridal veiling. And uh, I, I copied the veil and I, I made a new veil for Katie and uh, it was beautiful. And then I don't know if it was at the wedding reception or the next day, some, and the family member was there and they said, are you going to tell her about the veil? And I said, well, I have to now. Anyway, no harm done. The veil was returned you know 
and, and it was all good. But what I'm trying to illustrate is it's very easy to look after. It's nothing to worry about. I ironed all of this with my steam generator iron and um, I'll just show you it up close. Well, not up close, the full length. So it's um, got the piping around the hem. It's just gorgeous. And it makes me feel like, feel, feel like I'm in kind of a, show my age again, a Doris Day film or something. It's so lovely. It's got the white triangles, then it's got this blue. And uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know where I wear, wear them because um, they're a bit fancy for every day, but then I suppose we should wear fancy every day, shouldn't we? So that's the pajamas. So I thought I'd get those out of the way. And then I've got some beautiful things to show you. I hope you agree. So I'll crack on and do that now. I just think this is gorgeous. This is, um, obviously it's silk um, and it is 100% top grade mulberry silk. And that has um, anti-allergenic properties as well. So um, it's a beautiful gold, I think you'd call it, like a gold caramel colour with a black um, animal print. I've given up trying to guess which animals these are. And it's a blouse and skirt combination. I think this is so smart, so elegant. And obviously you've got the two pieces. So I'm just gonna show Rob, because he's in here. Look at this, Rob. Isn't it lovely? Pure silk. Sorry, a little interlude. Um, yeah, so uh, I think I'll, I'll put the sizes on, but I think I got this in an extra large. I did give them my measurements and I said, I'm an 18, I'm a fairly bog standard 18. I carry uh, weight around my hips more than my kind of waist and shoulders, but this fits perfectly. And um, I don't know what you think, but I think it's absolutely lovely. And you know, when I said, about kind of rethinking my wardrobe in a way it was I don't want to sound pretentious but it was about being maybe a little bit more sophisticated now I'm getting on in years <laughs> I don't think I'll ever be sophisticated but I think this looks absolutely delightful obviously you can um um tuck it in and then I guess it'd look more like a dress, but because I've got a bit of a tummy, I'm less comfortable tucking things in, but I'll let's see what that looks like. I mean, that looks nice too, doesn't it? I think this is so stylish and so classy um, and so very comfortable. And you know, you could wear this winter or summer, really. You could equally wear it with um, black boots. In fact, what I'm going to do now is I've got a black shirt to show you as well. So I'm going to put that on with the, the skirt still and put on some black boots so you get like a different vibe and kind of dress it down a little bit. But I think this would look really good with the collar up too, wouldn't it? Yeah. So I've kept the same skirt on, but I've changed it for this blouse. I've just remembered how to put the lights on in here. That should help a little bit. Um, and it's got this, um, what would you call that? Like a mandarin collar, I suppose, with the V and it's got the three little buttons and the rouleau loops, but they're not the stretchy ones. I find those stretchy elastic rouleau loops much harder to do. Now, I'm not sure about this with my neck. I think, I don't know, maybe I'm just focusing on the wrong thing, but uh, I do love the elegance of it and I do love you know, you could equally have it with no necklace, but I think that just this little Meneer necklace looks quite good. It's got a dolman sleeve, very comfortable. I think this is an 18 or an extra large. It does sit slightly high on my hips, but um, oh no, actually it can come down. It's fine. Again, it's beautiful silk. I mean, I think everybody should have black silk blouse in their wardrobe of any description because they're just so useful and functional and I put it on with the black boots and that just gives it a different look altogether doesn't it you know you could equally wear this skirt with a, a black cashmere jumper and uh, and the boots and it wouldn't look out of place anywhere really just going out for lunch or you know doing whatever um 
very versatile. I think if you get two pieces like this, you can switch them up. Now I've also got this jacket to try on. And now this is something I'd never heard of. This is 40 mom silk. I don't know if it's mom or momme, but it's M-O-M-M-E. And that is the 100% um, uh, pure grade 6A mulberry silk. So it's smoother, stronger, and it's beautiful. It's kind of heavier. It's more like um, a crepe de chine, I suppose, the feel compared to this. It's kind of got a matte finish. It's absolutely gorgeous. It's got the roll collar and um, I love it. Now, it is a tad small on me. It's the truth. I can't, I'm not going to pretend it isn't, but I would never wear it done up anyway. So that's fine for me. Um, but it's got this roll collar and it's double breasted and I think it looks super smart. It's got the um, inverted thing, which I know, you know, the little slit in the back, which I know is stitched up. I know it's stitched up, Pocket, pockets are stitched up too. But isn't that gorgeous? I mean, you could wear this anywhere. You could wear this to a black tie do, literally. It's, but equally, you could just wear it casually. You know, it's just okay on my arms, but I have got heavy arms. So all I'm saying, ladies, is if you order anything, be very sure of your measurements because returning is not as straightforward as with some of the shops we're used to in this country. Because obviously it's overseas, so it's got, you know, it's got a journey. So... I'll tell you, for a grey winter's day, this is just the dog's doodles. It's got these little buttons here. I hope you can see that fabric. It's, you know, I think because I sew and mum sews, we do appreciate a nice fabric and this is beautiful. So again, it was creased when I got it, but I ironed it up with my steam generator and it was delightful piece of cake. So um, what less I've got to show you. Oh, I've got a lovely silk shirt, so uh, a blue silk shirt. So I'll put that on for you now and, um, and show you that. So this is the final piece, this beautiful, beautiful navy blue silk shirt now they class this as oversized um it's not hugely oversized um i still got the labels hanging down the back hold on um but it's i prefer it actually because you know i've bought some in the past or i've got some in the past been given some in the past that have been too big and um make you sort of look bigger than you actually are this is great i've got it on with a pair of um black ponty trousers from next um which i quite like it kind of dresses it quite down i like blue and black together i know not everybody does it's got this fabulous inverted pleat in the back that just gives it that comfort and uh you know you could easily wear this with white trousers in the summer you could wear it with jeans you could wear it with shorts but it just elevates it elevates your style and it's one of those, if you know, you know. I mean, I'd look at this and know this was silk. It's just got that quality about it. Um, even the buttons are lovely. It's easy to style this stuff up. It's just so easy and it's such easy care. So, um, yeah, I think they're lovely. I think be careful with what you choose. If you're in doubt, contact them. Um, but... I've got a 15% discount voucher. It's Daisy Silk. And um, yeah, I'm more than happy with what I ordered. As you can probably tell. <laughs> I'm a bit of an open book, aren't I? So uh, yeah, thanks. And I'll see you really soon. Bye.